The main challenge for Europe's border control is the sheer scale of modern travel. Every year, more than 700 million people cross the EU's external border. According to the European Commission, by 2030, the number of flights in Europe could increase by 80%. That presents national border agencies with a huge challenge. Officers have a matter of seconds to process each passenger and must remain alert for hours at a time. If border checks are not modernised, there will be longer delays and queues for travellers. This is where technology can play a crucial role to assist border guards. Frontex's role in research and development is to connect national border authorities with the worlds of research and industry, who are the developers and providers of that technology. Modern passports contain biometric data in the form of facial images and fingerprints. Such passports can be used at automated border control gates. They are both convenient and secure, and release border guards to carry out more detailed checks. Member states are increasingly interested in using these gates. Frontex is working to standardise this type of technology across Europe. But not everyone goes through designated border crossing points. Protecting the public from cross-border crime, terrorism and other threats is the priority. National border agencies have to monitor 12,000 kilometres of land frontiers and 45,000 kilometres of maritime borders. Technology can help border surveillance to detect any illegal activity at the border. One technology with the potential to help maritime surveillance is unmanned aircraft. Pilots must take breaks. An unmanned or remotely piloted aircraft can stay airborne for over 24 hours. They could provide much greater surveillance capacity for search and rescue operations when rapid response is needed to save lives. This is just one example of the many areas in which technology can help improve the management of Europe's borders. Frontex helps connect member states to the world of science and technology to ensure that Europe's borders remain open and secure, no matter how busy they become.